I'd like to welcome Brothers Burn Mountain with Sister Colleen Myrie, uh, ceremonial sister tonight. Yeah, adopted. Adopted. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you, Karen. Thanks for having us. So the last time I saw the two of you, uh, you were uh, acoustic and you were a little quieter. There was a little different thing happening. How has this journey been? I think for us it's about uh, taking risk in our music and uh, I think that's the best way to find a new sound to experiment. Then you add in another another voice, another percussion dimension and harmonies. How does that, what does that add? Colleen is a soul singer and I think that's a rare thing in, in anybody and uh, we're just, it adds so much. That's all I can say to have Colleen singing with us. Do they say, okay, um, here's the word, sing harmony, go for it, or how, how do you work together? Um, they do do that to me. <laughs> they, uh, we don't say too much, usually. Yeah. Well, it's, yeah, it's, um, I just kind of feel their groove, and I hear the harmony, and I, you know, if they don't like what I'm singing, they'll let me know, but um, we just kind of, ha we just blend really well together. We have a really good, I don't know, feel for the music together. Pretty awesome, so who's writing the music? Um, Jesse and I collaborate on, um, you know, the poetry end of things. We're both poets and, and both uh, songwriters and at the same time, so there, there's no, um, we have no theory on how it works. It happens differently every time that a song pops up, and when a song does pop up, it's all usually almost always a surprise, sweet surprise to us. How does it come? Does it words, melody, which comes first? Um, I would say it's really simultaneous, um, even if we're a few miles apart. Um, you know, there's always stuff ringing through my ears. Uh, and uh, it's kind of like whispers and winds between us. We don't have to say much about it. We just, you know, we play and see what happens. So since I've seen you last, you've put out four recordings in two years. That's pretty insane. You think so? I think it's amazingly ambitious. I think, yes. I think more musicians <laughs> should push themselves like that. <laughs> What's in the works for you guys? What's the next recording? What's the next, or do you just want to breathe? Are you going to stay in one place for a little while and stay put? We're going to do all that. <laughs> well, we got a bunch of new stuff coming too. New, new um, you know, we brought out one or two tonight. And how do people get a hold of you? How do they follow what you have out there for recordings or tour schedules and all of that? I think the best way to, to um, connect with us is just to come to a show because we love playing for people. It shows. And thank you very much. And best, all the best to you, all of you.